Hello, fourth grade. So, I have been hearing that some ukuleles are getting out of tune, which makes a lot of sense after a week away from school. I found a great website. It's called ukebuddy.com. And if you type in ukebuddy.com or Google ukebuddy, it'll probably take you here. You can check out some great chords here and all sorts of chords like all the chords you could ever want which is really great um oh check this out so it's f chord right we know how to play f one and two and it's showing you that here this is the a that's also sounding and the c those are the open strings you don't have to press there but those notes are happening when we play f cool so we're going to go over here to the tuner um you can tap the tuning peg to hear what the note's supposed to sound like And also, you can use this microphone to help you tune. I'm going to click it. Yep, yep, yep. All right. When you play, it's going to hear my voice too. And when you hit, when you play your string, it'll show you. So we've got to know what string is what in order for this tuner to work. The G string is the string closest to your body when you're holding the ukulele. The C string is the thickest string. It's right next to G. The E string is the one next to that. And the A string is the one closest to the floor when you are playing. When you're playing, make sure your ukulele points to your left. So I'm going to start with the G string. I'm going to play my G string. Hey, I'm pretty in tune. Um, here's my G. I'm going to play the next one, my C. Got a little adjustment there, a little tighter it needs to be. Yep. There we go. Here's E. That's pretty much there. Here's A. That's good too. So, guys, I'm going to untune my ukulele for the purposes of showing you how to use this thing. I'm going to untune everything. I'm going to tune it down. I'm going to make it flatter, looser. Because if we go tighter, we could snap our strings. Okay, so I got everything way out of tune. I need to know which string I want to do. I'm going to start with the G string closest to me. You could also follow the string up to the tuning peg because the top of your ukulele has one, two, three, four tuning pegs, and here they are. We'll start right here with the G. All right, I tuned my G so low, it's now an E. It's two notes flat. So I'm gonna gently start tuning my E up, my G string up. And now it's up to F, gotta keep going. F sharp. Now I'm on G, but it still needs to go till the lines meet. That's pretty nice. Okay, next is my C string, the thickest one. Okay, tricky thing now, right? My C string is so low it's an A. Don't get confused, we're not tuning the A string. We're still on the C string, so I need to bring my A up to C. A, B, C, up two notes, making it tighter. A sharp, getting closer. B, getting closer. C, and now I'm playing C, but it's a little, a little too flat. Still getting closer, and got it. Let's see what happens if we go a little too far. Now, my C's too sharp. It's almost a D flat. And I've got to bring it down back to C. Tune slowly. Um, we don't want any broken strings. I guess I'll be mailing you guys strings if they break, huh? Okay, now I did my G. It's drifted. I'll bring it back. And the C. Now I'm going to do my E string, the one that's next to C. It's the 
second closest to the floor, and third farthest away from me. E flat, E. I'll make it match. Oh, that's perfect. And finally, A. My A is super low. It's a G. Cool. Let's check them all. Here's G. Here's C. Here's E. And here's A. Okay guys, use this Uke Buddy tuner to help tune yourself. Um, keep in mind the strings from your body, they go G, C, E, A. G is closest to you, C is the thickest one, E is next, and A is closest to the floor. If you are having trouble tuning or your ukulele is extremely out of tune or you just feel like you're about to break a string, send me an email and we'll get in touch and we'll get your ukulele tuned, okay? Thanks everybody. Um, good luck tuning. Take your time, go slowly, and be in touch if you have any issues. Thank you.